Hi everyone, in this video we're going to start building an HTML form. Uh, so we're, we're going to create an HTML page um, and we're going to talk about the form tag, the attributes that the form tag takes, and then in future videos we'll start to build out that form and in the end we'll have something that can actually uh, take inputs and be submitted. So let's start up let's start off so we just have a blank HTML file here um, and so we're going to quickly scaffold out an HTML page so using uh, using VS codes built-in stuff and so we have a blank HTML page uh, we'll just put a quick header okay, we can just open that up real quick and beautiful okay so we got something showing showing up to the page so first step of building out an HTML form is the form tag and so the form tag is going to serve as the wrapper for all the elements in our form and so just like any other form or uh, any other HTML element that can serve as a wrapper we can put any HTML elements in here so depending how you style the form, this can have divs with elements in it, or it can have UL tags, or anything you can imagine can go inside the form tag. But to make a proper HTML form, we do need a form tag. So what is special about the form tag? Well, the form tag interacts with the, with the server um, by its default behavior um, and it does this via its two attributes and so it's two it's two special attributes so these attributes you don't add to any other HTML elements so forms can have an action attribute and a method attribute and so the action attribute says hey when I submit this form where should I send the uh, the information? So say pretending that I have stuff I can type into this, my name or whatever. Um, when I hit enter, or and I or if I click the submit button, um, where should this information go? And when I'm when I when I talk about where, I'm talking about where in the server. So by default, HTML forms take information and send it to a server. And so, just as an example, I could put welcome.php, and that says, hey, take the information I submit and send it to this file, welcome.php. Um, and for the method, this is just the type of HTTP request this should make. Um, and there are two possible uh, two possible values this method can take um, and that is the get method or the post method and so we will learn about what both of those do this essentially defines what kind of uh, what kind of HTTP request should be made when we when we click submit and then again the action is where it'll get so when in this case once this form is built out if I hit submit or press enter, um, then the information will be sent in an HTTP GET request to welcome.php. If this was changed to a post, then it would be a post request instead. So we'll um, we'll work through that in um, in a future video. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.